So today we're gonna dive into the second DIY kit that I got from Taobao. And this one is seems pretty easy. It's um they call it an LED acrylic art. So it didn't come with any QR codes to scan for instructions, but it came with a manual. But this manual is not an instruction manual. It is a design manual. So they do have some, um, oh, this is quite cute. The one, the holding hands one is quite nice. Um, you can make it as a Valentine's Day gift for your loved one. Someone who loves Doraemon or Pikachu. So there's quite a selection of designs here, but there's no instructions. So we do have materials in the box provided that is an acrylic piece that is still sealed and protected, so no scratches on that at all. It also came with this wooden LED installed inside, and that's where we're going to slot the acrylic into. And it came with a ruler as well in case you need it to measure out some straight lines. But the most important tool that we'll need for this DIY is this little device. So it's actually a very pointy and this tip is quite sharp. So I would suggest not doing this DIY for like really young kids, preferably from like teenager onwards, that would be better. So I won't be using this manual. Instead, I'm going to create my very own design. I'm gonna do a customized family portrait of myself, my husband and our dog. And also I wanna include my previous dog that passed away last year, that's Cookie. And it would just seem like a nice family portrait art of all four of us. So let's get to designing on the tablet and we're gonna transfer and print it onto paper. So I would say I took about 30 minutes to create and draw this design that I want. And I have printed it out in two different sizes so that I will know which one works better for the acrylic. If I use the big one, I'm not sure if the LED lights would be able to reach all the way to the edges. So let's go with the smaller design. To begin, tear off the protective sheets from both sides of the acrylic. Arrange the drawing to your ideal spot and simply secure it with some tape. I noticed that the acrylic was really thick and it affected the depth and it was really hard to trace the drawing to a T because of the thickness of the acrylic. To be honest, I just kind of eyeballed it. It was really tricky to carve small curves and sharp angles as well. Another challenge was checking which parts you have carved but I realized if you hold it at an angle, you can see the lines on the acrylic. Or, another method was to cup your hands at the side to get a clearer view of your carvings. One final check to ensure I didn't miss anything. Okay, so now is the moment of truth. I have plugged in the LED wooden thing and you can see the light shining in my face. Oh, bright, yeah? Don't look at the light though. I am going to slot this right on top. We shall see if you can see anything when I turn the lights on. <gasps> Oh my gosh, that's so pretty! Oh my gosh, I love it! Wow! Oh, let me turn down the lights a bit so maybe you can see it better. Ooh, look at this! It's so cool! I didn't know it would work! Because honestly, my main concern was am I putting enough pressure while I'm scraping the acrylic? But it turns out, I think I am, but also, I was holding the pen scraper thing with like my dear life and it made my hands hurt. But it seems like I probably don't need that much of force. This was extremely easy to make. The only time consuming part was designing something that I want on my tablet and getting it printed. But other than that, if you honestly just use any of the pictures provided in the design pamphlet, then it's going to be even quicker. It took me 10 minutes to carve on the acrylic and that's it. 
So if I didn't make any mistakes on my tablet doodles, then I would probably take 30 minutes. So 30 minutes plus 10 minutes, that's 40 minutes. And it's really, really quick. And it's quite nice to put it by a bedside also. So I highly, highly recommend this DIY to do, especially if you want to get it for your boyfriend or girlfriend. And it's nice that you put the effort to like design something and like carve it out yourself. Uh, it's a really sweet gift. Although you have to take note that this one doesn't come with a power head, so you will need a power head to plug this in. But other than that, it's pretty simple. It's a very thoughtful gift. So if you guys want to try this DIY yourself, I will put the link to this DIY kit from Taobao in the description box below. But in the meantime, I got one more coming up and I'll try to rush it before August because I'll be going on a hiatus. And I will see you guys very soon. Take heart, be kind, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!